everything. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back. Okay, so this is an absolute, oh God, this is a video I have been dying to put out there for so, oh, for weeks on weeks. I've been working on this for so long. It is my favorite vintage shops in New York. I'm so happy that I finally finished it. Anyway, I'm gonna get stuck right in. It's a fairly long video, so speed through any at any point in time if you want to. Use this video as your guide. I'm thinking about making this a series, so we'll see how this goes. But anyway, for anyone who wants to know my favorite vintage shops, obviously this is not every shop that's in New York, there are so many, but I had to like, you know, narrow it down into my top ones. And yeah, sit back and I hope you enjoy watching this video. Sorry, it's a little bit shaky. I haven't got a proper vlog camera yet with a stabilizer. So it does go a little bit ooh like that sometimes, but I, I do apologize in advance. Anyway, I'm gonna try and stop waffling and get stuck in with the first one. All right, so I'm gonna show you Artisan Flea that is in Brooklyn, Williamsburg. Um, I focus mainly on two shops and the first one is my absolute favorite. Done. To the woman with the fabulous so, hair. That is, that is so you. This is like my imaginary friend. It fits you. <laughs> Look at with, with your shoes. Oh God. I mean, I have to have the full look. How else am I gonna find my fresh prince? I don't know what does. The whole thing together is spectacular. I feel like I need to try it on. You absolutely have to try it. Oh, you're terrible.
Okay, so next up you're gonna see Urban Jungle. This is one of my top three vintage shops in this entire video. Oh, you have to see in that video. I show you this belt that I bought there. It says Southern Comfort. It's this gorgeous brass, look at that buckle. <gasps> You're gonna see in the video this belt, but look, it says Southern Comfort across the top here. And then it says under the belt written at, at the bottom here. So brilliant. Anyway, watch the video, hanging out with my friend Jonathan. And uh, yeah, it's a good laugh. Vintage part two. <laughs> Look at the shoulders though. It's like it's like the Balenciaga. Who wore it better? I'll do a split screen of you and then the Balenciaga runway. Next up is a Beacon's Closet. Okay, there are several Beacon Closets all across New York, but this particular, I'm gonna show you two in this video. And the first one you're gonna see is where I found these corduroy pants. There are, men, there are men's corduroy pants in this gorgeous chocolate brown. Beautiful, very worn in, love that look to them. I couldn't believe that they fit. It was like a fingers crossed thing, and they did. Anyway, I'll let you watch this. <laughs> Okay, so I quickly popped into No Relation, which is one of my favorite, if not my favorite 
vintage shop in Manhattan. Um, I need to go home and shoot a video. The video I'm shooting is like my favorite new in things on um, online at the moment. But I was just passing by, so I had to go and look. Look what I got. Oh my God, I got these leather looking pants. I haven't even tried them on, but there's a trick that I use to see if they fit. Um, I got the this velvet... Um, wide leg pants actually they're ann taylor old ann taylor and oh god another corduroy hold on let me flip this around so, you... so i also oh, put my bag down first i also yeah so i got this these are wide leg velvet brown culottes and like a gorgeous chocolate color a black corduroy blazer as if i don't have enough corduroy blazers and this beautiful dark sapphire blue um skirt so i'm gonna i haven't tried anything on except the blazer i was just in a rush because i needed to get out of here but um what i'm gonna do is i'll try this on for you later Okay, so I, I hope you enjoyed seeing that section from No Relation. That is actually my hands down favorite vintage shop in Manhattan. Um, these are the leather jeans that I was telling you about. It turns out that they are leather. I actually thought they were faux leather, but they're not. It's a genuine leather pants and they fit perfectly. Love those. And I also picked up this sapphire blue skirt. Look how gorgeous. <laughs> It's beautiful, it's, it's really like long, it's sort of like a midi length, which I absolutely love. Because the skirt is so long, I like the idea of balancing it with a heeled boot, which is to me just looks so cool. So I got this as well from there. I'm just showing you better pictures because you saw me in the car and you couldn't quite make it out at the time. And then I also found these pants, these chocolate brown velvet wide leg sort of pants. These are fantastic. They fit high-waisted, which is an absolute bonus. These look so good on. And these two velvet pieces were about $6 each. So no relation is such a good price point. It's just, it's just ridiculous. Oh, and the corduroy blazer, hang on. This is one of the blazers that I picked up. It is in this simple biscuit kind of color. And then I found a black one, which I think I gave you a sneak peek of last time, but this is it properly. And again, I picked it up at the same time at no relation that I picked up those two velvet pieces. This is fantastic, it's so good. And again, this is from the men's section in the downstairs part of no relation. So make sure that you go to the basement because a lot of people forget and it's easy to walk past that staircase. You'll know what I mean when you're in the shop. Go downstairs, they have so much good stuff down there. I love it and I always do it.
Okay, so that is my lot. That is my my best vintage shops in New York guide for you. It's my gift from me to you. Keep this video bookmarked. Next time you're going to New York, watch this. Anyway, that is everything. Um, I can't think of anything else to say. Follow me on Instagram. My name is Karen Britchick. You will see a lot of what I'm showing you in this video on there if some of it has not already started to filter its way onto my feed already. Um, and I think that is all. I can't think of anything else to say except subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I am obsessed with this bloody high-waisted pant and this, oh, and this shirt. Oh God, look at it. Sorry, I know this is the end, but I just want to look, look. Look at the color. Look at the colors. Oh, look how it changes color. The, the back even, look at that. Look at the color. Look at the colors. Of, look at the sleeve. I tell you, Love Day 31, man. That place rocks, the one in Astoria. Anyway. That is it, I'm gonna stop waffling. This video is gonna be a flipping marathon. In fact, it's probably a movie length by now. Sorry, YouTube. Um, and that is it. I will see you guys on Tuesday. Have a good weekend, take care, and um, that is it.